Hello, how is everyone doing? Yes, believe it or not, it is I, um, Baby Kiki 007, or it's reversed on here, it's 007 Baby Kiki. And I know I've been gone like forever, but I'm still here and I've just had a few things going on in my life. But I want to do a few videos today um, just to kind of give you a little bit of background. Um, my husband has been a little bit sick, so I really haven't been dedicating all of my time to making like as many videos as I used to but um, I'm trying to work them in um, with my daily uh, activities so um, that's pretty much all I'm going to say on that for right now but um, just to let you know what I've been using on my face um, so I want to talk about what I've been using on my face um, I know I did a video about juicing I still juice um, but I drink almost a gallon of water a day now. I've started incorporating a lot of water in my diet because that's one of the things that I need to do. But um, this face is just basically I washed it with black soap. Um, and I started using this, um, if I can find it, I should have poured it out before I got on here and started rambling. But um, the BB cream, I saw a lot of people talking about that. And um, I needed to use some type of moisturizer on my face um, when the weather starts getting cold because I have a tendency to get, like, I'll call it, <laughs> I don't call it dry mouth, the ashy mouth. Like, all the way around here, I get, like, really dry. So, I've been using this Maybelline BB cream. Um, it's been a few weeks now, and um, I just want to show you. Um, the difference, I don't know if you've tried it, I'm sure you've probably seen another um, YouTuber talk about it and how it works for them. But I just want to give my two cents. I actually love it. I have been using um, this L'Oreal Hip Pigment. I think I showed this to you guys in another video. Um, but I don't really always want to use this. Sometimes I just want to put a moisturizer on with a toner and keep it moving. I don't always you know, want to use liquid foundation. I, I have used both of these together. Um, not something that I absolutely have to do, but on a day like today, I was home sick, so I just basically just needed to moisturize my face, so wash my face with black soap. Um, this is the, um, I think this is the darkest one they have. This is deep sheer tint. So this is like the darkest one that they have. Hopefully you can see the color on that. But I'm going to show you what it looks like. I have any earrings. I have on my hair. I just wrapped it around each each other to put it in a ponytail but one of the videos I want to do today also is I've been wanting to start wrapping my hair up so um, I'm going to show you how I started doing those with my locks also so first off BB cream my thoughts on it I like it I think it works really good um, I think the color I, I guess the color for me works well I'm not the darkest but um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like this is what the color looks like so it's not too bad and how I've been doing this I know people do not use <sighs> their fingers all the time but sometimes I've washed my hands so my hands are clean um, so sometimes I use my fingers sometimes I use the brush but I just dot it on in a few areas of my face and it it spreads pretty much so this is what it looks like before I start to um, work it in so let me show you. So I'm just going to start working it in. And the mirror's over here, so I'm sorry. I have to look over the other direction. And I know I might not seem like it's enough, but I mean, I could add a little bit more. But for the most part, I really just needed a little bit of moisturizer with the tint. Come from over there, King. Sorry, my dog. As usual, whenever I'm doing a video. He wants to get into other stuff. Maybe I do it fully so you can see how it looks once I add the um the um, liquid foundation on it. So now that I have, as you can see, it, it pretty much blends pretty good with my with my skin tone. I don't have any problems with that. Um So I know it might not look, I might still look a little tired. I am tired because I was under the weather today. But um, 
it's just a moisturizer. It doesn't make your face white, you know, because some things can make your face look white. But I want to show you what it looks like when I put my um, liquid foundation over it. Try not to use too much of this because I'm not going anywhere. So, this is the liquid foundation. The liquid foundation is not really it, it's not really a moisturizer, you know. It's just like liquid foundation. What else can I say? But when I do want to do a full face, and I know I'm looking crazy right now because I'm trying to blend all of this in in a timely fashion. And I'm using my iPhone today for the first time to do a video because I normally do it from my camera. But I got sick of that thing running out of um, memory and I had to keep deleting stuff off before I can even add other stuff. And I was just like really irritated with it. So, I know this might be starting to look a little, um, I don't want to say clay. But it actually blends in really well. So this would be just like a basic, like a basic face. Nothing too spectacular. I already have one this lip balm on this chapstick. So this is like um this is what it looks like after I put on the BB cream, after I put on my um high intensity pigment liquid foundation. So it basically just gives me a nice even palette. Um when I don't plan on doing like a whole lot, like today, like I'm not going anywhere, so there's no need to me put on a bunch of stuff. Um, what I normally do is put some eyeliner, like some of my eye now, if I could find it. I'll put eyeliner under the bottom, pencil eyeliner under the bottom, and then I use liquid liner in the top. So I got to go kind of off camera a little bit, sorry. Just about done with the pencil. So that's the pencil, and then I use my NYC liquid liner. I'm still using that. I actually want to try to find another one to use because um, I don't know. I just want to try a different one. Okay, let me put this on real quick. And I'm sorry that I wish I gotta find a um like a holder for this camera for this phone or a better, better way to position it. So I'm so sorry. Maybe I can cut this where it just skips there because I didn't realize that was gonna be all out of the camera view. So sorry. I wasn't going to do all of this, but since I started it. Okay, so give me two seconds. I'm just going to do that and I'm going to move right back over. Guess the back down. Try not to do really anything too extravagant. I'm so sorry. I just want you to kind of see um, what it looks like when I mix the the BB cream and the foundation together. Which I think it makes pretty good. I mean, it can have a pasty look to it if you put too much of it on. I don't really need a mirror for this part. Well, to get all up in the mirror. But this is just to give you an idea. But, um, so I've been using the BB cream. I haven't really been doing, well, I wasn't doing like eyeshadow for like a long time because it was just too much for me to do in the morning time because I work a different shift now. So I'm at work earlier than I used to be. So it's just been, I don't know, a lot of changes in my life. Just trying to get used to still using the Nika K, um, face powder. Still using that, and I'm gonna also put a little blush on, just so you can get a 
more of an idea of how it all looks together. Hopefully this isn't coming out too powdery. I don't think it's too powdery. Um, I had somebody ask me in, a, in another video about my um, eyelashes. I've never done my eyelashes, eyebrows, I'm sorry, about my eyebrows. I've never done my eyebrows, so um, I don't really, I don't really tell you how I do them. I just <laughs> use my fingers to try to get them to go in the direction I want them to go, and then that's it. And um, I need to put some blush on. Let me move this over here really quick. If you guys could just bear with me. I'm so sorry. I'm so unorganized. See, that's what happens when you don't do videos for a while. You get all unorganized. Let me see if I can get this set back up. Okay. So then the next thing I want to do is put a little bit of blush on my cheeks. And that's it. And that's pretty much has been my... Um, my daily routine, I haven't been doing a whole lot. I've just been keeping it simple because I just need simplicity right now in my life. And that's it. I already have on like some, some kind of lip gloss or lip balm actually. But that's it. So um, if you haven't used the, the BB cream, I used the one by Maybelline. I don't know if there's more than one kind, um, but this is the one that I have been using. So. And I got this from CVS. I'm sure it's probably cheaper in Walmart. I just have a, a complex by going to Walmart sometimes because I just want to get in and get out. And there is no getting in and getting out when you go to Walmart. So, basically, the video was about the BB cream. Um, again, I'm going to try to do... I try, I'm going to try to do more videos than what I've been doing. I will admit I have been a slacker um, because, I've again, I've had a few things going on. But I am still juicing. Um, I just have started drinking way more water. Like I've been trying to drink a gallon of water a day. Um, some of you, some of you, I'm a little more personal with what I've spoken with before in the past. If you want to message me, that's fine. But I just don't want to put everything out there um, as far as why I haven't been on uh, so much. But um, if you're one of the people that I talk to, by all means, you can send me a message. It's okay. But um, my hair. It's been growing. I did it about three weeks ago. And I'll show you what that's looking like. And yeah, my hair grows out fast. So, this is what my hair is looking like these days. I know three weeks is looking kind of rough for three weeks. But I know I did sweat it out. <laughs> because I went to a 70s party. And um, I have pictures if you follow me on Instagram. It's um, babykiki007 on Instagram. It's opposite of what the YouTube is here. But here is the length of my hair these days. My longest So, sorry. I got a um, call that came through as I was recording. I was showing you my hair and the length and the growth and all of that good stuff. But, um, sorry about that. I guess that's going to be one of the setbacks of recording videos from my phone. Is when a call comes through, it knocks me out of my video. Hopefully I can chop it, piece it together some kind of way. But anyway, the purpose of the video was to talk about the Maybelline BB cream and how I like it and how well I think it works. How well I think that it works. Um, I definitely would recommend it if you just need something that's this is a moisturizer, but it's um, a moisturizer and toner um, all in one. It says there's eight benefits on here, but um, I guess FPF 30 if you go out in the sun. It does hydrate it. It does smooth. It does blurs imperfections, enhances, brightens, adjusts the skin tone. It has 0% oils or other heavy ingredients. But I would definitely, definitely recommend using this. Um, I was showing you my hair and um, I can do that in another video. Because I want to talk about some earrings in another video. And then I want to also show you, um, a, we might do the scarf and earrings in the video in one. But, yeah, so, um, for those of you who've been following me, that are still following me, I thank you so much for continuing to follow me. Um, I promise to get back on here and be more active. It's just that I had some things, again, you know, that kind of, um, changed my daily life routine. But, um, but I'm still here, still using the, some of the same products, you know. Um, i get into that in another video, but, um. Thanks for hanging in there with me, and I will see you guys soon. Um, I'm about to do another video, so I'll see you in the next video, family. Be blessed. Bye.